We look at the roster that we have, the experience that we're adding, of having played together. It just reinforces, this is not a dream, this is not a hope, this is what we're here to do. My name is Matisse Theibel, I'm from Sydney, Australia, and I'm a boomer. When I was in college, we came to Australia the whole time, I'm like telling our coaches and our players, like, hey, like, I'm Australian, I have a passport, like, I can prove it to you. Nobody cared, nobody cared. Fast forward my rookie year in the NBA, Brett Brown's the head coach for the Philadelphia 76ers. It came up again that I was Australian, and he's like, we have to get you on this team. You know, the best thing about Matisse is that he's absorbed everything about Australian culture. Fight, fight. Matisse brings an energy that is so warm and a lot of the guys gravitate toward. It's not a leap of faith. We know exactly what's necessary and we have all the tools that we need. It just seems to be a part of our DNA. If you don't have it in you, you probably won't keep up. The basketball IQ for Matisse Thibel is off the charts. Heinz Thibel, he'll take off the three and that looked pretty. When we go back to our professional seasons. Guys are coming up to me like, dang, Australia's got some good players. I'm like, oh yeah, we do, huh? Like, you think so? As that goes, we'll, we'll earn the respect of other leagues, other players, the world. Yeah, being an underdog is it's not something I think any of us are afraid of. So now to be here, back in Australia, playing for the Boomers, being able to put it on this green and gold jersey and think that I get to go and do this for Australia. You know, these are funny things that come full circle in life.